गुड मॉर्निंग एवरी वन एंड वेलकम टू द ट्रेड टॉक पॉडकास्ट द सॉफ्टनिंग ऑफ यू एस जी डी पी डेटा एंड डिक्लाइनिंग एम्प्लॉयमेंट रेट्स हैव इंक्रीज द चांसेस ऑफ इंटरेस्ट रेट्स कट इन द कमिंग कैलेंडर ईयर टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी फोर स्टॉक मार्केट्स आर ट्रेडिंग विथ पॉजिटिव सेंटिमेंट्स स्पेशल इक्विटी मार्केट्स एंड गिफ्ट निफ्टी इज अप फोर्टी पॉइंट्स हावेवर FIs have been selling in the cash segment for the last two days. So while looking at the setup of the market, we saw smart recovery from the expected levels of twenty thousand nine fifty, twenty thousand nine seventy five, and it was in fact it was very close to the resistance level of twenty one thousand three hundred. For the day, we are of the view that uh, between twenty one thousand three fifty, twenty one thousand four hundred. we should be careful we should look for taking some profit on long positions or in fact we should look for reducing weak long positions in the market in case if there is any correction in the market then close to 21000 or 21100 we should look for considering uh, creating some long positions but at this point of time the strategy should be to look for exiting weak long position if there is any higher opening till the markets are not sustaining about 21400 we are of the view that we may see some consolidation sort of activity in the market for the bank nifty there we saw spectacular uh, recovery from the lower levels almost all the stocks recovered from the lows but private banks did extremely well hdfc bank specifically was up and uh, based on the formation we can expect further more activity however the overall formation of the bank nifty is suggesting us that 48050 and 48250 are the challenging levels till these levels bank nifty is not crossing we are going to see some sideways sort of activity and based on yesterday's terrific performance our view is that in case if there is any correction then close to 47300 47400 levels we should look for taking some contra bets in the bank nifty apart from that if we go through with other indices then uh, there we saw some recovery but uh, specifically from the nifty it basket uh, we like uh, take mahindra which is around some 1250 1251 uh, there we are of the view that it is expanding its trading range so in case if there is any activity or bullishness in the it companies uh, then we can expect take mahindra to do well and it can go up to 1300 levels uh so the pivot level uh, for tech mandra is around 1260 and above that the next resistance level is between 1300 1330 levels also uh, for uh, few uh, bfsi stocks in that we like bank of baroda it recovered very well from the levels of 215 it is above the pivot level of uh, 220 so the next level could be around 229 which was its previous all time highest level and in the best case scenario 235 uh hdfc bank which was in fact underperforming uh since last so many uh, months uh, was uh, in fact doing well uh, in yesterday's trading session uh, from 16 uh, 80 85 the stock can move to the next levels of 1730 or maybe 1770 in next few weeks or few days so there also we need to keep a watch and now 1660 or 1670 uh, will be the support zone for it so there uh, we feel that uh, we should uh, look for taking some contra bets in hdfc bank and apart from that uh, uh, this uh, bfsi and it uh, capital goods and infra stocks uh, should be in the uh, watch list along with some mining companies uh, in that nmdc gmdc as well as nagarjuna constructions gmr infra should be on the watch list that's all from my side for the day with this i'm ending today's call thank you very much for listening me and have a nice weekend to all of you